Hi guys, how's it going? So today I'm gonna be reviewing a product. I got it yesterday in the mail, and I'm gonna be doing a little bit of target shooting. My blow guns right here, as you can see, I have my big blow cold seal, and the one I can't name we call it, um the Deathly Reaper. I have no name for it, but um this is a hint for what today's video is gonna be about. So yeah, let's get into the video. So um, dun dun dun. dun. Here's my new toy. It is a Cobra Mini Crossbow. What I really like about this one is it has the little um, Cobra with a snake on it. That's what this basically is. It is an 80 pound self-cocking crossbow. Um, I don't understand the self-cocking feature, I guess. Um, you have to cock it, you just do that. And pull that back, I'm not going to. But you get the idea. There's the safety. Um, so yeah. This is really hard to string. Well, that's not the point, so I'm gonna flip the camera around and point it at the target. I am shooting in my garage tray. A couple little features I want to show. That is a safety there. Wow, the camera actually focused. You just want to slide the bolt under there. There's the adjustable sights. There's everything there. There's that. This was around $50 on Amazon. Um, it came with three bolts, but I suggest buying them because they freaking break like tarnation. That makes no sense, but I am going to set my um, phone up here so you guys can see the target. Oh, uh, Redneck Engineering got a little, can you guys see that? You can see the can? Yep, there we go. So, how you pack it basically, you do a little lever on the thing, you pull it back until it clips into place, you just pack it, slide the bolt in. Um, 200 feet per second. Okay, that's where that one hit. You guys can probably see that. And then nailed the can right there. Oh, look at it. A good shot, too. I nailed the bee. It's a hornet. Whatever. Yellow jacket, actually. Shout out to uh, Yellow Jacket Targets. Great targets. All right. I'll flip the can to the other side. And now, um, what's your food for? How about, here, let's bring the camera back here. Got this, and I'll show you how, I mean, I cock it. You can probably do it many different ways, so let me turn the camera around and then show you. Okay, so, I'm going to step in here. This is the gun. Here, 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 here. There's a little lever right there. You push it down, releasing it. Do that. I like to put that little nub into a carpet. To help me pull it back, because it is pretty hard um, to pull back. Jeez. Okay. So you can see me. How you do this now is you take it uh, and just slide that bolt in there so it won't come undone, right? I don't know how well you guys are going to be able to see this. There's the target. As you can see, can you see it? Oh, you gotta. 
I think I shot a little bit high on the Hornet, but let's go check it out. Um, yeah, just a wee little bit high. All right, let's move the target to 10 yards. Oh, wow, it's windy out here. Whoa. Okay, let's, um, yeah, target is out there. I am going to um set up the um, thing here. You guys can probably barely see the target out there, but um yeah, I'm gonna do that in there. Oh, packed it. I'm just going to slide the bolt in. There we go. I don't know if you can see it. Here, here's me shooting the gun. Boy. I just have it rested on my sister's scooter. Oh, perfect shot. Look at that. I think that's right in the kill zone. This gun's very accurate. Look at that. Oh, bee. Oh, it's a bumblebee. Hey, how's your friend be doing there, Jimmy? Oh, too bad. Looks like Jimmy's done, though. Jimmy is shot. Yeah, so as you can tell, this is like a pretty accurate gun. Um, there's not much more to it, I guess. This is just a great gun. It is around fifty dollars on Amazon. Well, it, it, it's forty nine ninety nine. All you little, all you people out there be being like, it's fifty dollars. Don't okay, it's not. I'm gonna fire three rounds. That was right. Where you want it? Loading up another bolt here. Um, pushing these down. Do that. Way high. That was my bad. I flinched. Can't tell you why I flinched, but I can tell you that I did flinch on that one. Right in there. It's my first. Sorry, I stopped the video. So my first shot was absolutely perfect, and my last shot was absolutely perfect. See, that was the one that I flinched on. I could have said I was shooting at that one, but I wasn't. So there's the bee. That's like... Mm -hmm. <laughs> right That's like the heart of the bee, I guess. Um, that's jar liquor and another jar liquor. If you don't know what jar liquor means, it means like... Um, it's on the line of like a better score, I guess. If that makes any sense whatsoever. Here. Let's take a mighty far shot, okay? So, we're gonna freaking put this thing out here. Okay, I'd say we're at, eh, eh, here I'll count. One, two, five, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty yards there, so, um, here, I'll show you how far we are. Here we are. So this is where I'm shooting. Way out there. We'll set. It's kind of hard to see the target, but you can see it, so. Don't be complaining. So, yeah, we're about 20 yards. I've never really shot it this far, I guess. Um, I don't know. Let's see how it works. Nice. It was high. Um, I don't know what to say about it. I'm pretty, I'm, I think it was probably me that flinched or did whatever. That was way to the right. Maybe it's not me. 
maybe the gun is only accurate to like, to like 15 yards. I don't know. Last well, shot. Yeah, I'd say the gun's only accurate to about 15 yards. Because I'll go up here. One was high. Ah. Oh, I just stepped on like part of a deer jaw. Or whatever. Yeah, I did. Ah, uh, that freaking hurt. Yeah, it's not very accurate out to that distance. See? One's there. I'd say about five inches high. This one's like eight inches to the right. And that one's like um five uh about seven inches to the right and about three inches down so here let's put it like um let's go right up so that's about 15 yards right there i'll check one two 12 13 14 15 15 yards. Here. Zoom in for y'all. Can you see that? Right. It doesn't matter if you can because you're going to have to look through it. Right here, I can check to see if you can see it. Thank me later. There you go. I'll go. Freaking bougie people. Alright, let's um take aim. There we go. <laughs> that was right in there. That was ooh. Chat was freaking good. That was high. And last bolt. I'm more of a, I'm just gonna shoot three. Oh, weird. Um, so on the last one, I did aim for the, um, top right target. I forgot to say. See, I, see, on these two, I, I, was, I was aiming for that target, you know? Yeah, I, yeah for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No doubt about it. Wasn't, but um, I'd say this is about accurate to about 15 yards, give or take. You know, I wouldn't, um, I don't know. This is a great bow, I really like it, but um, it has its limitations for sure. But um, I would recommend getting it if you're looking into getting one and you stumble across this video, just get it. They're a great cop, they're a great bow, I love them. I mean, it's a great bow, excuse me. And, um, yeah, I just suggest you get one. Thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> like, subscribe. I said subscribe, but whatever. And hit the notifications bell. And we'll see you in the next video. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.